Today we're going to show the installation of the Casamane Rod Shop Stainless Steel Early Commodore LS Pipes. As you can see here, your engine can be installed, bolted in position with the Rod Shop mounts and cross member, and the extractors can be installed last. The right hand pipe is in three pieces. This makes installation a breeze. To make the installation easier on the right hand side of your vehicle, remove steering shaft, undo your two rack bolts, lower your rack and pinion out of the way. I would recommend taping up the inner guard and the extractors to save any damage caused when installing this side. As shown, the rear half of the pipe is now installed. Make sure rear half is installed first, followed by the front section and then by the tail pipe. When purchasing a Casamane Rod Shop LS conversion kit for your early Commodore, you will be supplied a, a gear reduction left hand side starter. The starter motor is not to be installed until the left hand extractor is in position. The left hand extractor will need to be installed from underneath the vehicle. To make life easier, if you have access to a car hoist, or worst case, make sure you install some jack stands and jack the vehicle to the correct height. In the same procedure as the right hand side, we recommend taping, bubble wrapping, to all your painted surfaces or extractor to save any damage. Now your left hand and right hand side extractors are installed, it is time to connect the rack and pinion by the two bolts and the steering shaft back in place. The time has come to install your rod shop supplied left hand side starter motor. The left hand side pipe is not fully installed. This will allow more clearance when installing the starter motor into a tight place. You have now reached the final stage of installing your rod shop LS pipes. If you require any assistance when installing a rod shop kit, we can be contacted via our email, website or telephone.